Hey everyone, what's up? This is Blaze. Welcome back to some more Pirate 101. So, I was just kind of like sitting here looking at my stuff, like my companions, and the music in Valencia is actually really awesome. So, dang it, I hate that you can't hit escape. So, let's just. Oh, the music's all the way up. I need to turn this up. I hear the music. I hear my, I hear my ship louder than the music. Dang it, I hate that I can't hit escape and go to this menu. I think this is a different, different part of the song. I don't know. This part wasn't as, isn't as good as, as the other part. But yeah. So I was just like listening to the music, and it's actually pretty good if you just like sit there while you're doing this stuff and listen to it. So what do we have for today? Well, I'm going to return to Skull Island and turn in this quest, and then we are going to get my level 17 spell, which I didn't get. But first off, we need to go land so I can mark. Well, I think you can mark in Skyways, but I don't really care. We're just going to go over there. And then we'll mark and head back. Oh, I have a thing. Oh, gosh. Get out of the way of that. I don't know where this mark is. So if it's at the place, I'm sorry. But I'm not going to take the risk. Where's Captain Steve's Villa? No, it's not. It's actually not at the place. Okay. Oh, my gosh. Go away. Really? They came out of nowhere. We're going for the, the one lane here. Our ship is faster than theirs. There's so many ships here. Go away. Anything else to do? Apparently not. Is it that little island over there? Oh gosh. There's a really green wind lane. So we have to head that way, but there's like a blockade of ships everywhere I go. Oh, there's little gears in the, the wind lane. Oh my, really? Why is there so many ships? Okay, I think I can sneak past them. A little observatory. So I had my companions doing like pet stuff, and then one of them brought back an egg. We're marking here. Mark this spot. Let me look at the egg that I got. Uh, that's that companions. This spider thing. Ice scarab. Hmm. Okay. There's that. We're heading back in there. Uh, for companions, I switched out Rappy for this guy because I don't think this guy's that good. He's, he fizzles all the time. Which seems to be the thing with witch doctors. We're going to go with these companions. <clears throat> Sorry. Because they're pretty good. They seem to be pretty good. Can't pose a god. Uh, Bonnie Ann's pretty good. So we'll try out. Some people said Old Scratch would be good. So, I don't know. Maybe we'll switch them out. This is the Buccaneer place. I get three companion points for this, so I might as well just turn this in. You have some hats. It seems you won. Impressive. Especially okay, is that it? Yep, three training points. Maybe awesome. Yes. Now we're gonna head over to Vladima, I think, or just Vadima. I think it's just Vadima. Yeah, Vadima. All right, what else you got? Oh, there's actually nothing at 17. Hmm. Unless I already got it, I don't remember. So 18, we get two stuff. Awesome. All right, we'll be back. We'll be back at level 18. What is my my backpack's okay? All right. Not sure if I have anything, anything else to talk about that I've updated since then. Since last time, I didn't really do anything. I didn't really do any leveling or any of that stuff. This looks scary. Look at those crates. They might have our books. Let's deal with the guards and check them quick. Dang it, I have to deal with the guards. Okay, so, battle to start off. I think I'm good to go. Yeah, let's just do it. Okay. I, looks like there's some explosive arrows in the middle. I'm never gonna use this. Okay, next, like, major boss fight, I'll use this, but I don't know. I'm not really too concerned with using that. So that gives, like... I should check my spells, because I don't need a lot of these spells. Oh my gosh. Alright. Go with that. Slap him. Slap him. Shoot. Uh. Because they do have that buff, that like chicken thing. That's pretty good. I like need to put that higher on the thing so I can use that right away. Because it's pretty good. 
All right, Ratbeard, I just recruited you, so you better be good. I think the thing I'm going to do with training points is just save up a bunch of them. <clears throat> oh, I hit the, hit the barrel. Nice. I'm just going to save a bunch of them until I feel like my companions are bad, and then I'll just... Oh, my gosh. And then I'll just level them up so they're good. Because I have, like, 30. I don't know. Until I'm like really like sucking at at fights, I'm just gonna hold off. Okay, he's pretty much dead. Is he dead? Mm, yes. I don't know. I feel like my companions are pretty good right now, or at least decent. That wasn't that much damage. Maybe this guy is like major armor. <laughs> You're a sniper, you don't have armor? What is this? Oh, might as well. Decreases his accuracy by 15%. Or criticals, okay, never mind. Good. Spam, 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 spam. Okay, such crates. I don't like this at all. Okay, don't pull me. Let's try that tower. I think I can use my mountain here. Got it. Got it. Let's take it back to Gonzago. Who's Gonzago? Dang, he's probably it's probably where my other port used to be, but I had to port to the thing because Oh my gosh, it's so close. Because I needed to go back. Well, I didn't need to go back, but I, I just wanted to check. Just in case I did have stuff to learn, but next level we do. Twelve thousand? What did I just click? I did not mean to click that. I don't even know what I... I just randomly smashed a button on my keyboard. Alright, we'll go down to a hundred and then we'll turn it off. I don't know what it... Well, did not mean to boost there. Uh, we are heading to Snivella or Civilla. I don't even know. So, uh, I'll, I will cut back to when we get there. Okay, so we're just about here. Uh, while I was, like, flying over here, I looked at, like, practice points. I'm not really sure what is good to use practice points on. Because I, um, I used my first one on, uh, Ruse or whatever it's called from the privateer class which is the heal which makes sense but I'm not really sure if uh, what I should use my, my future ones on because I'm not sure what's good or what would be beneficial I'm just gonna look at this quick seagulls I'm already doing a quest to find mechanical birds so I don't know if you want to comment like what would be good for a uh, for me to use a witch doctor to use on practice points then uh, that would be helpful Oh, a mechanical bird. So good. So good. They're actually on the map, so I could just look at the map and go find them, but I only get 25 XP for that, so. Not too concerned. These guys can still pull me. Even though I'm in disguise. So yeah, thank you to anyone that comments and tells me. Or suggests what I should use with those practice points. Okay. Gonzago, here's uh whatever I got for you. Oh, I didn't get you anything, sorry. This is loud enough. She like right here? Awesome. Yes, I can read this. 
It is a simple code the Armada favors. I see the books you are looking for. It seems they have been sent on to Cadiz. Cadiz? Let the books go, Captain. Sneaking here was a bold, but uh, Cadiz is the center of Kane's power. Who's Kane? Going there is a suicide. I fear we were lost. Marco Polo's secrets are lost to us now. Should I sneak into that place too? Perhaps not. This guy knows what's up. What's up, Aldemar? Sibella is not the only place Polo kept his records. Tell me, have you ever heard of a Grangia? Nope. Grangia is a small isle not far from here. It hosts an ancient village where Marco Polo retired. Marco Pollo was entombed under the great chapel in Grangia after his death. I have read that many books and papers were buried with him. A colleague of mine, Lorenzo, is in Grangia writing a book. Find him. He will help you find Pollo's tomb. I have to go raid his tomb? That's like in Harry Potter where uh, Voldemort goes and raids Dumbledore's tomb to get his wand. Is that correct? Yeah, I think it is. Yeah, because Dumbledore has the, the Elder Wand. Okay, let's not get pulled again. Let's not get pulled again here. Um, okay, let's go. So yeah, and we get a staff for this, which I don't know. I don't feel like it's going to be better than what I have, but uh, if it is, awesome. Oh, can I collect the same bird twice? No, no, you can't. Okay. I feel like I should mark here. So, we are heading over to the tomb of Marco Pollo in Grankia. See how far away it is. 4,000, not too bad. Let's see. Oh, it's right here. Okay, yeah. Is it is it blocked by that island? Yeah, I'm probably going to have to sneak in past all these ships again. Like the... I don't know. The ship per like square mile on this to scale on this map is insane. There's probably like 10 ships per square mile in this place. Per capita. <laughs> the ships per capita is too high in this place. Okay, Gronk, yeah. Okay, uh... Formal has never seen anything like this. The Armada is eating the island. Aye. And when they're finished here, they'll do the same to every island in Valencia. After Valencia, they'll do this to the whole spiral. That's gonna take a long time, let's be honest here. Do this to the whole spiral? You're gonna need a bigger machine. Never mind that. Let's find this Lorenzo fellow. You're gonna need a bigger boat. All right, let's go. Uh, oh, he's right here. Who goes there? Oh, you are no cloth of work. Thank goodness you have come. The Armada has a deep They are destroying the island. Centuries of art and architecture swept away. Go save it. The tomb of Marco Polo. It should still survive. The fiends have not yet the good luck with your search. I hope you find what you seek. Oh my gosh, whoa. Okay. Wow. That was close. I almost walked right into these guys. Hmm. This looks a bit difficult. So that guy's path is that. Can I just like look at the wall like and whiz and not care and then they won't see? Oh my gosh. Booking it! Please, please no pull. Please no pull. Okay, 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 okay. Safe zone. What the heck? In here? I don't like this. Oh my gosh, go away. Oh, I can go across this. Where is this chapel at? Chapel, chapel, chapel. Chapel. Blast! The clockwork piled up too much rubble. Find a different way in. Maybe Lorenzo knows another way. Oh, why do I have to go back to him? Do you know the struggle of getting over here in the first place? Is there a different way? It's gotta be a different way. Who's that? Oh my gosh. 
This place sucks. What is this? Okay, let's... Oh, my... Nope, this is not a... Uh, it's not a way to go. <gasps> Book! Oh my gosh, it's like... Ugh. It's like that Cave of Solitude and Wizard. Sorry, oops. Why is there always old catacombs underneath chapels? Or at least old chapels. I just hope it's easier to get to these catacombs than to, to the actual chapel itself. What are you guys doing? Okay, let's see. I gotta like let the quest giver or the quest helper figure out what it's trying to point me to. It takes a second. Cause it's not sure. Alright, this looks like it. Let's find that tomb. Okay, good. Oh, these are guarded too. Gosh. Uh. Uh. I found, I found the tomb. I I found that this is this is the tomb. There's two of them. There's two Marco Pollos. I already found it. Uh, let me guess. The tomb's at the way end of this catacombs, probably. Oh, it's even inside another place. That's exciting. Hmm. What like realm am I in? Because I haven't seen I haven't seen another person in so long. It didn't even show me the realm. Show me the realm. I mean, it's, eh, it's not probably it's not that busy of a time. The tomb of Marco Boyo. Hopefully, it won't end up being our tomb. Blue windstone. We take for ship. There's no map piece, Captain. We are beaten. Did someone? Did we do this, or did someone else? An opportunity. Who is down here? Don't bother trying to hide. <laughs> I can hear your. How did we miss this entire group of of people over here? This joker type guy who are you Gosh. no kinsman of mine i'm sure a human how marvelous how in the spiral did you get me here i took know a ship. why you're here and what you're looking for too late we took the shred of poyo's map weeks ago your pathetic efforts are in you know you're crazy when you have a staff of your own face when you have the face of yourself on a staff there that's that's when you know you're crazy. Wait, I know you. What are you doing here? You're supposed to be in Skull Island, aren't you? Yes, the Armada knows all about you, pirate. Surrender the piece of Poyo's map you have, and I will let you live. You know I'm tempted to let you go. Your soul. Oh, I just realized that he's like talking in two different. Like a thorn in the side of Deacon. Like faces. Bishop or Cain himself. Then again. So there's like two phase. Captains, attack! Fight Cadre. Commence staggered assault. Black Cadre, incapacitate the intruders. Okay, so it's like a two phase guy. I... Farewell, pirate. I am sure we shall meet again. We've got to get the officers. Faster ones named service, or they'll keep calling reinforcements. Alright, easy enough. Service. At least like the the ones with the black hats, yeah. No, well, not really. They're just these ones. Oh, they're this one and this one. Nope, that is Sentis. This is really confusing. This guy right here is the only guy we have to defeat. Defeat, run, run. You can't run that far. Run, yep. Yeah. All right. If I didn't like mega hit that, that would have been sick. I have poisoned a robot. There you go. Campo's like, I'm not wasting any time. He's almost dead.
These guys do a little bit of damage. There you go. Is that going to kill him? Heck yeah. Alright, I win. We're done. <laughs> Wait, who else is the name service? Oh, this guy is also named service. Okay, this guy over here now. Everyone do your crits. Alright, we're good. Epic hit. This guy's toast. Or he will be. Wait, what? Oh, I was gonna say. I was like, I did not misclick. There's no way. Oh my, he has one health. He's already dead. Rapper doesn't even need to finish this attack. That was just style points at the end. Alright, we win. Enough of Valencia. Let's go back to Captain Steed. We haven't even been in Valencia that long. It's like the second episode. Dang. I should go to the Life Fountain. Whoa. Wait, am I? Oh, okay. I thought I thought it would teleport me. Well, I guess I wasn't even bound to a Life Fountain in that place. Oh, hopefully I'm close to the Steed's place anyway. Mm -hmm. Let's see how far away it is. It's not that far. I can take the uh, the wind lane over there. We'll be there shortly. There's a storm gate to Aquila, which I think is the final world of up to date of Pirate 101 so far. Because if uh, the pet games are anything to go by. That's the last world you can go to when you're training your pet, so that's what I assume. But we're only level 16, so... Or, I mean, 17. That's my nautical level. I'm 16 nautical level. So, probably not going to be heading to Aqua anytime soon. Is that Captain Steed's villa over there? Yeah. How much XP do I get? I feel like I should be getting more XP. Like, I haven't gotten, like, any XP this episode so far. Well, hardly. I mean, I need like 2,000 to level up, don't I? Come on. Yeah, 2,000. I need more XP than 175. Captain Steed. I got... I got a windstone. I don't know where the windstone is, too. but I don't know. I'd be kind of sad if we're already done with Valencia, because that was really quick. We'll see. Oh, there's a mechanical bread right here. Fuck it. There we go. Your search has been in vain. I can see it in your eyes. Anyone who would vie with the Armada must become accustomed to defeat. There may be one last hope. I once knew a unicorn, Varro by name. He revered Marco Poyo and was his finest student. Varro sat beside Marco Poyo's deathbed. He alone heard the explorer's last words. If anyone might know more about the map, Varro does. Varro made his way to Monquista and joined some. Didn't we see a unicorn at St. Bonifo's Abbey? Uh, I'm sure. We'll we go back to Monquista for this. Um, I'm gonna mark here. So if we ever have to go, oh, there's an owl here. If we ever have to go back to Captain Steed, we'll have that port. Unless something else comes up, I need to port there. Okay, this is gonna take me a while to get back to Monquista. I think I might just go back to School Island and then I don't know. I already got three of the birds. Oh, you can collect birds multiple times. Look at this. Watch. Will this give me four? Yep. Okay, you can collect them multiple times. Wow. 
Okay, let's see. Did I get my experience for that yet? Yes, so I got a new item. Which is not as good, because it's only level 10. Okay, so what I'm going to do is wait for this mechanical bird and then get that, and then I'm going to head back to the St. Bonobo's Abbey. And we'll talk to Brother, Bra Brother, Brother Varro if I could talk. So, I'll see you guys then. Okay, so we finally made it. It took a while. Like, dang, getting back to Monquisto is a struggle. I do know you can pay like a thousand gold to teleport here, but I only have nine thousand gold, so it's kind of a lot of how much I have right now. But we're heading into the Abbey, and then we're gonna probably wrap this episode up after we talk Listen to this well guy. I break a vow to tell you this. Marco Pollo was the keeper of a terrible secret. He burdened me with it in the hour of his death. Pollo spoke of El Dorado. He said that no one must ever go back there. Powers asleep in El Dorado that could destroy the spiral if they awaken. He spoke of his map, whispering that Christopher Clark, his navigator, kept it safe in Cool Ranch, the land of Pollo's birth. This helps you? Cool Ranch, a lovely place, if you like dust. Are you going to Cool Ranch? Oh, okay. So that that was uh, Valencia. <laughs> All right, uh, Skull Island. So we're going to Skull Island, and then we're going to go to the Stormgate to Cool Ranch next time. Well, that's a good place to end it. Dang, I did not plan that because I have no idea how the storyline of Pirate 101 goes. So next time we will be heading to Cool Ranch. That'll be actually pretty exciting. And then I also get to change the thumbnail to whatever Cool Ranch looks like. So that'll be exciting. But anyway, thank you guys for joining. Uh, make sure you like the video so that I know you guys are enjoying the series and uh, to also support the series uh, with that like. So thank you for that. Uh, subscribe so you know when I post the next Part 101 video so you, you get a notification in your sub box on YouTube. And uh, anyway, just thank you guys for watching and continuing to watch the series because it's a lot of fun for me. I like just kind of going back to it and posting whenever you know I kind of feel like it. It'll be a couple times per week, uh, hopefully. So that'll kind of be the schedule. But anyway. Uh, thank you guys for watching, and see you guys next time.